if you want to install android application on your unsupported windows pc then this video is gonna help you a lot because in this video i'm going to show you a method by following this method you can easily install android application on your unsupported pc whether it may be 4gb 8gb or 16gb ram this method will also work for windows 10 and windows 11. so friends first of all you'll have to access the bias menu of your pc to access the bias menu of your pc you can refer this photo otherwise you can search in google on bias menu just enable the virtualization technology now after restarting your pc just click on start menu and search for features and there you will find turn windows feature on off just click here here enable virtual machine platform windows hardware visor platform and windows subsystem for linux and then click on ok here you will have to wait a little bit now just by clicking here restart now you will have to restart your pc now just open a browser and you will have to access this website the link will be given in the description here just scroll a little bit and click on just latest here you will find the latest version of this file just for windows 11 latest version and on the same page you will find windows 11 windows 10 and all the needed information are given here here it is 4 to 6 gb is recommended and 8 gb minimum and 16 gb is recommended 4 gb to 16 gb will be supported cpu architecture all the details are given here you can find ssd is must okay installation guide updating guide all uh, uninstall uninstallation guide all are given here you can easily read the guide if you want to download for windows 11 you can also download for windows 11 and if you want to download for ARM processors you can also download for ARM processors hence I am using windows 11 then I will go to the latest version by clicking here and here you will find windows subsystem for Android for windows 11 and latest version okay just scroll a little bit and here you will have to download the mighty mind the GFs that means you will find google play store okay we'll have to download the 90 mind the g apps just click here and it will start the download if you are using those 10 also you will have to click here and here you will find the link and you will have to click the 90 mind the g apps version when the download is completed you will have to close the browser when the download is completed just open this pc and go to download folder download folder go to compress file and here you will find wsa just right click on it select extract to all extract here you have to wait for some time please don't delete the folder after extracting the w WSA zip file because if you delete the folder then it will hamper the WSA itself so don't delete the WSA folder after extracting the zip file okay after the extraction is completed you can now delete the zip file and now just click win key plus r on your keyboard and here you will have to type gpedit.msa and press ok group policy will be open here double tap on administrative templates then just go to windows component and scroll a little bit here you will find windows powershell just double click just click here and here you will find turn on script execution just right click on it and click on edit here you will have to click as enabled and from the drop down select allow all script just click ok and close it and now just open this folder again open this folder and here you will find a file named install just right click on it and select run with powershell here the installation process will be started you will have to wait here just click on continue again just click on continue just to wait here after completing all process here play store will be opened just you need to sign in quell setup and then click i agree and click on allow play store is opened now just close everything and click on start menu and search for windows subsystem for android just open it and go to advanced settings and enable the developer mode okay just close it and again search for play store and here is the play store you can now install everything in a play store is installed on your pc if you find this video helpful then Please don't forget to hit the like button and don't forget to share this video with your friends. We will meet on another day on another talk. Till then, take care.